Hmm. Today we find ourselves over here on familiar ground of the three wizards, the stones in the valley. I'm sitting down, and I'm with uh, our shaman dog, Obi Dog, with his uh, with his new used uh, shoulder harness. Anyway, well, now that we're back out here in this very um, uh, warm summer day, about up to 80 or 81 in the San Fernando Valley, at this location. Uh, we're now up to the realization and the news that uh, the United States is at 317 over over 317,000 deaths from uh, COVID-19 or whatever the hell the killer flu is. And that Britain has uh, now a version of COVID that may be 70 times more deadly and faster. Many countries are shutting off their airport uh, I mean, airplanes coming in from other countries, from Britain, I mean, Britain, to Britain, but the United States is still kind of waffling whether they should uh, cut off the uh, flights to Britain. And also, Walter Reed Medical Center is examining some samples of this said COVID uh, deadly UK uh, hybrid virus to see if our vaccines will have any power against it. And it's about one in every 80 or one in every 50, who knows, uh, of uh, residents of L.A. County now is believed to be um, uh, COVID positive. And there's been over like, a, uh, what is it, uh, 5,000, uh, 5,400 5, uh, hospitalizations so far. Sometimes some of them are just hysteria or psychosomatic, but a lot of them are indeed actual COVID and the ICU capacity is down to zero in many hospitals and of course our eager Obi dog doesn't seem to worry one way or another you know for him it's obviously every day is a new snack of some kind give me what yeah so for the most part you know obviously it's a good time obviously for some and uh, trying time for others the rich are obviously with the uh, money that can buy their versions of either Moderna or the Pfizer vaccine there have been different types of side effects that have been the news and the politically connected are doing hooplas of demonstrations that they are in fact uh, taking the tests in some cases it's been empty needles for the cameras so we're so mixed uh, we still have some time uh, to see what are the uh, different versions of the vaccines what they're going to do on the body but it's now uh, as we pertain to this question to the three wizards Oh, what shall become of us? We are in this very, very trying time. And it's an, indeed, uh, you know, it's, uh, it could be in a graveyard for all I know. Uh, a few personages that I know already have come down with um, symptoms of COVID-19. So it is spreading. The noose is tightening, as they say, right, little Obi? And Obi, obviously, um, he's been appearing in my dreams. Obviously able to speak. Obviously giving his sense of canine wisdom. Obviously sacred to uh, all sorts of deities, particularly Lord Shiva, Bhairav, and uh, um, Shalol of the Aztecs. So uh, little Obi always is, no, is always in the know, right Obi? Yeah. So we're going to see really the way it turns out. And uh, they're now begging for people to stay indoors. A lot of people are staying indoors, but uh, technically not to visit anyone for the um, Christmas holidays to stay indoors not even to visit your families. So it's um, definitely a trying time. And the energy of the three wizard stones, as they protect us, give us the wisdom of the ages, the rock of ages, as they say, and that we're all gonna be able to come through this together. Okay, Obi, Obi. Okay, say goodbye, there we go, say goodbye, there we go, okay.